Try and run to the first with Taylor. And he takes this up to the 40-yard line before being corralled. That's good for an Indianapolis first down on the gate of 10. Defense had a chance to get off the field here on the opening drive. Couldn't do it. I know that we go into these meetings with coaches, and sometimes maybe we can get you know, a little bit numb because they're always going to talk about how important third down is and affect offense and defense. In this case, one capitalized, and the other, as you said, had a chance to get off the field and didn't get it done. Taylor on first down. Taylor able to get this one all the way up to about the 46-yard line. Seven yards on the pickup there, and it'll leave him with a second and three. going to give this to Taylor, and down he goes at the 49, a three-yard pickup. Some of the most unselfish players on any football team, defensive tackles, because we ask them to just eat up blocks and have other people to make tackles, but when he can make a play himself, as we just saw there, that's a big day. Sanchez on a punt here as he sends this one away. And did they keep it in? They did. They kept it in. It's down to close to the goal line at the one-yard line. So here are the Bears banked up to start their initial drive. And they will be led out by their 6-3 quarterback. So this is what we find out about the game plan and the trust factor, don't we? In this situation, the natural thing is take care of the ball. Run it inside. Everyone cover it. Just, you know, get yourself some room and let your punter punt it out of there. But when you've really got a QB you can trust, you might want to take a little shot early and try to create some space. And he'll get this only up to about the three-yard line. DeForest Buckner in on the tackle. The last one good for two. Here's second and eight. And off comes to Montgomery. And he's upended at the six as they double their room to maneuver on a pickup of three. And on the Colts, an extra defensive back in there now on third down. Back to throw, Fields. That's complete to the Memphis man, Anthony Miller. And he will have the Bears first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. I'll give the defensive guys a little bit of credit. They didn't let the deep ball beat them on that play, did they? No, the, the drag. That guy can be your safety valve. We saw it right there. Yeah, and it picked up a first down for him, too. So a little breathing room now. First and 10 at the 17. Now it's Fields. And this is what you've got to do against a quarterback like him. You've got to keep him in the pocket and not let him get to the perimeter because once he gets outside, that's where he can really hurt you. Got to assume 
this defense will be charging again here. It's second and 15. Another try after the first down sack. Fields. And this one incomplete. Too much contact to hold on to that one, and it's third down. You definitely would like to hit on that one because now you've got a third and long showing up, and you just know defense is going to be getting after it. They are pinning their ears back, and they are coming. They want third and long. They'll look to throw. Throw left side complete. That's Miller. And he will have the Bears first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. Boy, a nice play there as they wind up converting on third and 15. I know many people like to throw to the tight end, maybe in a little flexed out position because he creates mismatches with his size. The slot receivers do the same thing with their quickness, their speed, and their route running savvy. 